Maimun and Achibuka is a group lead of 19 girls making daddies in Kamocha. These have been able to advance their business with the support of the Innovation Fund that is from the Gakan Foundation through the In Their Hand. It has at least boosted our business up. However, we had started with the savings from the kids, but since we received the Innovation Fund, the business has now expanded from the little saving we had to the bigger amount now we have. How? We even bought more things that we did not have. She says killing from the AKF has helped in transforming their lives. Now they can save their profits. They buy themselves what the girl needs. For example, girls mainly need pads, dressing, you know, the things that are majorly needed for what? For a girl. Rowena Kamasai, the project manager, says the project is aimed at making better the lives of young people from underprivileged areas. So we assume that getting together these young people, engaging them in discussions on a weekly basis, and really focusing a lot of effort and time and taking time with them to, uh, to give them information around their well-being, around sexual and reproductive health, around um, self-efficacy, independence, understanding their communities and their value, we know that these are life skills that they need, especially for those who are out of school. The Aga Khan Foundation has invested a sizable amount of money in the program to empower them to make their own health choices while decreasing the rate of unwanted teenage pregnancies within Kampala and Arua. The program is planned to end in December. So we invested around $2.2 .2 million and uh, this uh, was co-funded by a partner called Children's Investment Fund Foundation. Yeah, so now we've set them up with the, uh, the skills and the resources to start their businesses and now what, what we're focusing on is handing them over to the uh, district officials so they can continue to get training, they can continue to get funding, and um, they can continue to grow their business, not just for themselves, but also for everyone around them in their community. Sarim Uhuru, the mayor for Kampala Central, has welcomed the skilling program. The, the president has a skilling program, a presidential skilling, so that's the way to go. And I've been mobilizing our youth, especially those who could not go back to school, in the ghettos to be skilled. So you can see some of them are doing the catering, some are doing the tailoring, some are being DJs, some are being welders. So I'm happy to see someone can be skilled because when you have to go and ask for a job, at least you have a profession. Recognizing the importance that sustainable livelihood opportunities play in the determination of adolescents' health and well-being, an innovation fund was established for adolescents within the In Their Hands program. It is intended to support the youth in establishing income-generating opportunities that not only benefit themselves, but also improve the situation of other youths within their communities. Jumakiria, NTV.